Hello everyone, it's me, Mr. Mario. Today I'm going to be showing you something new for your JTAG and Reset Glitch systems. I'm going to be showing you all how you can install Freestyle 3, which is the new Freestyle dashboard. Now, essentially, this is an upgrade from Freestyle Dash 2.2. It's a mix of that and the RXE, which is the long-awaited real Xbox experience dashboard. So it combines those two, like it gives you cover flow, it gives you connect integration, and a few other nice things, and it supposedly runs faster. So I'm going to be showing you all how you can install that on your systems. So first off, I'm going to be providing this link, but go ahead, go to it in the description, and you can go ahead and come down here and download whatever you want. Now, normally you can just put it on a flash drive if you download the 7-zip installer here. What I did, I just downloaded an ISO and I just burned it over to a DVD and I installed it that way. So all you have to do is just get one of those, either transfer it to a flash drive or transfer it onto a disk, and then just run it there. It's pretty self-explanatory. Just run it XEX menu or whatever, and you should be good to go. But the link to the download description will be in there. Once you have it downloaded, we can go ahead and go over to our Xbox and I'll show you what to do. Alright, so once you're back on your JTAG, what you want to do is open up either Freestyle Dash or XEX Menu if you're going to be launching a straight file, or if you're like me, it really doesn't matter since you have an ISO. Now I have Freestyle Dash 2.2 and we'll be updating to Freestyle 3, so just booting up the ISO right here, and once Freestyle 3 installer pops up, you want to do remove existing install because it has to be a fresh install. But you want to install F3, and I always install and configure Dash Launch, and I download the latest version. Because I have an ISO disk and I don't want to reburn a disk every single time, you might as well just do download latest install. Now, it does take a while because the servers are kind of slow, but, you know, to me, that's what I do. Anyways, let's just go ahead and let it update, and let's see what happens later. Alright, now once that's complete, Dash Launch is going to come up if you selected that. Now there's really not that much you need to change here unless you know what you're doing, but there's never anything I need to change, so I'm just going to exit out of that. Now Freestyle 3 is going to pop up once you hit B, and this is splash screen for it, but as you can see, it doesn't really look that much different, but I'm going to show that it is Freestyle 3, and it does have some elements of RNC in it. So I hope I helped you all out. Now I'm just going to show some footage just showing the cover flow and all that, and it looks real slick, I will say that. So I hope I helped some of you all out. Thanks for watching.